Hi guys! I hope you're having a lovely day. Today, I will show you the process of making a Kerberos pot. I use earthenware clay and use the coiling technique to build the body of the pot. As you can see here, slowly building each layer, pinching and smoothing the clay out. The pot was inspired from an illustration of a bronze sculpture from antiquities. Now a brief background on this mythical creature. Kerberos in Greek mythology is a three-headed dog that guards the entrance of the underworld. It is the pet dog of Hades. He is described with heads of snakes which grew from his back with a serpent's tail. He devoured anyone who tried to escape the kingdom of Hades, the lord of the underworld, and refused entrance to the living humans. The sculpting part of the heads probably took the most time uh, from making this pot, but this is the most enjoyable part for me. So I'm just really detailing each head, making sure they're pretty much the same size. For the glazing part, so I just showed you the textile, so it would be green and blue colors for the glaze. I used Mako glazes for this to complement the red colors of the succulents. After it's been fired in the kiln, here is the pot and I really like how it came out with the colors interacting with one another. Let me know in the comment section below which color combination you would have chose. Anyway, now this is ready for planting. The succulent plants that I chose for my garden is this one, the dragon's blood, and this is the trailing jade. This is the crassula momiji, so I like the trailing ones, looks like snakes, and this is the crassula campfire. And I just use my concoction of succulent soil. You can buy you know, succulent soil pre-made in garden center. So this is just uh, me planting the whole thing. So thank you guys so much for watching and supporting my channel.